There's good news and bad news. Those words my father said to me. It was big news that was going to change the course of my life. Which one do you want to hear first? Uh, the bad news then. From next month, due to work circumstances, we're going to move to a country 10,000 kilometers away from here. What? Moving abroad? What about the language? The food? What kind of country is it? Oh, I don't really know either. The language is really sophisticated, and it's going to be in the countryside. It's so far away that I can't even imagine what the communication environment or even the standard of living is like. My father's sudden transfer overseas, getting sent to a place like that. Did he get demoted? I swallowed my words that almost came out. There's two options for you. Either you come along, or you don't. No, no, it's all too sudden. My name is Takuma. I'm a sophomore in high school living with my father. I know, but I don't have time. Please, decide. It was a question that was all too sudden, but rather than going to a country I don't even know. Fine, I'll stay. Either way, I was thinking of living on my own after entering college. It's so sudden it caught me off guard, but I'll somehow make it work. So, what's the good news? The bad news was a serious matter. The good news should be just as big. I'm uh, going to remarry. You're going to have a new mom. What? Uh, since when? It's true that for him it was really good news, but this is all too sudden too. Uh, um, congratulations, I guess. But your new mother is coming with me, so I don't think you'll get to see her too often. Oh, it was news that doesn't really affect me after all. But your new mother has a child, and they really want to stay. So I'm glad you told me you want to stay. What? Does that mean... I was worried about a middle school girl living on her own, but I'll be relieved if she's with you. What? Just like that, my father took off to an unknown country, and I was to live with my stepsister who I just met. Too many things were happening at the same time for my brain to keep up. How are things going to be after this? Um, I'm Takuma, your brother. Nice to meet you. I'm Ryo. Nice to meet you. And so began my living with my sister. Living together all of a sudden. It's such a surprise. Yeah. Uh, let's eat for now. I'll make something easy. Oh, I'll make okonomiyaki. I bought the ingredients. Oh, she can cook. How reliable. But what if she serves up an okonomiyaki burnt to crisps? No, I have to eat it deliciously as her big brother no matter what. Here you go. Whoa, it looks so good. It looks like I was concerned for no reason. I hope you like it. Let's eat. What? Salt and pepper? Uh, not sauce? I almost said it out loud, but... Uh, uh, thanks. I swallowed my words. Big brother? How is it? Mm, yeah, it's good. The okonomiyaki itself was good, but... Thank goodness! Her sense of taste is unique. Very strange. Salt and pepper? I started to worry a little bit for the future. What? You started living with your new brother? Are you serious? It's like a movie! What is he like? I told my friends at school about my brother. Um, I don't really know yet. I don't think he's a bad person. Apparently he goes to Waimani East High School. Huh, that's the same school my brother goes to. I'll ask my brother what kind of person he is. Oh, thanks. I really want to know what kind of person my brother is. The next day. Hey, what did he say about my brother? I ask my friends as soon as I get to school what kind of person my brother is. Oh, uh, yeah, well, if I'm to say, apparently he's really quiet, so not a lot is known about him. My brother said that's all. Sorry. I'm kind of disappointed. At school, I'm dull and almost invisible. All right, I'm taking attendance. Today's absence is... Takuma? I'm here. Ah, oh, Takuma, you were here. I didn't notice, sorry. This happens on a daily basis, but I don't really care. Because... Mm, I'm kind of hungry. 
It's a little early, but I guess I'll start eating lunch. Hmm? Doesn't it smell kind of good in here? Aren't you just hungry? It's almost lunchtime, so hold on. Nobody notices even if I start eating my lunch like this. Three months passed since I started living with my sister. I'm home. I think we're starting to get used to it, but... Welcome back. What's for dinner today? Oh, I have a shift today, so I won't eat. But I'll make it when I don't. Uh, sorry I'm making you eat by yourself. It's fine. I'll do it myself, so don't worry about it. It's easier that way, too. Uh, yeah. I feel like she's getting colder as the days go by. I caught a brother for the first time. But all I hear are rumors of him being invisible at school and nothing good at all. Ah, uh, I was so excited, but he's just a dull loner. It's so unfortunate. This isn't good. I'm a dull character at school, but not at my part-time job. Hello! Oh, bro part-timer Takuma. I'm counting on you today, too. I'm a high school part-timer, but I'm known as a pro part-timer because I'm the best at my job next to the manager. Today's a busy Friday, but we only have three people working instead of the usual four. Most people would dread this, but... Welcome! Two beers and gyoza! Thank you very much! The seat in the back is ready! Go ahead! Alright! Two large sizes and one beer to table five! It fires me up as a pro part-timer. The next day... This is Keita, who's starting from today. Takuma, teach him the ropes! I'm Keita! Nice to meet you! N uh, nice to meet you. Can a guy like this handle our busy restaurant? I made this for practice! Give it a taste! Ah... I started eating without any expectations, but... Well, what is this perfect boiling time? The presentation is perfect too! You've already mastered the skills I've spent a year acquiring! This person is no joke! It, it's delicious! I respect you for being able to create this flavor in such a short time, Keita-san! <laughs> really? I'm glad to hear that! This person might be the real pro part-timer. Uh, I'm home. Oh, you were still awake. Hey. Are you doing your homework properly? It's none of your business. I'm going back to my room. Hmm, she's really cold. I want to get to know her better as brother and sister. I wanted to talk about this with someone, but I don't have a friend I can talk to in the first place. Oh, Keita-san seems popular, and he probably understands girls more than I do. Being desperate, I asked Keita-san for advice. I don't know what to do anymore. Hmm, girls love presents, so why don't you get her something using your pay? Ah, presents! I didn't think of that. Thank you, Keita-san. I'll ask Ryo if there's anything she wants. The next morning, I decided to ask her. Er... Hey, I'm gonna get paid soon, but is there anything you want, Ryo? Tell me anything you want. Something I want? You're going to buy it for me? Then I want a bra. B what? B bra? I made a weird sound unintentionally. Yeah, a bra. I'm in the middle of puberty and it keeps growing so it gets tight really fast. Uh, uh huh. Uh, I see. That's tough. I didn't know how to respond. The, then, let's go buy it together next time. Although I said that... Oh! This is the place the models on social media were talking about! Brother, how about this one? Oh, this one's nice too! Uh, yeah... This is my first time coming to a place like this. What kind of advice am I supposed to give? Uh, but aren't Rio's choices way too gaudy? Shouldn't it be more basic for a middle school girl like her? This lace one is so cute! What is that? That's almost see-through! No way! No way! This fabric is so shiny, like a mature adult! What kind of seductive design is that? No way! No way! <laughs> this one's the most extravagant so far! There's barely enough fabric. But this is the most popular one. Maybe I'll get this one. What are you gonna do wearing that thing? You uh, should take better care of yourself. I yelled at her without thinking. It hasn't been that long, but we're siblings. I couldn't overlook a middle schooler trying to pick out all the gaudy pieces. What? Why are you angry? 
<laughs> oh, I regretted saying too much. I can't just stand still. I need to go after her. One hour of looking for her. Rio was in front of the house. Oh, Rio, you were here. Oh, I'm sorry for getting so angry. I have to apologize. Rio must have been scared getting yelled at all of a sudden. Is what I thought. No, brother. Don't apologize. I ran away because I was scared at first, but I was actually happy. I... What? You're getting divorced again? I was just getting used to my new dad. Quiet! When I say I'm getting divorced, I'm getting divorced. All you need to do is shut up and come along. Just be thankful I'm taking you with me. Yes. My mother remarried and divorced a lot of different men. This is her fourth remarriage. I grew up without feeling my mother's love for me. I didn't have anybody to scold me before, so I was really surprised when you got angry at me. Real. But the fact that you got angry at me means that you care about me, right? A lot of emotions took over me, and I ran away, but I was actually really happy. Brother, thank you so much! What? After that, we went to the department store again to look for a bra. Brother, how's this one? Yeah, it suits a middle schooler like you, and it's pretty cute. Really? Then I'll get this one. <laughs> Thanks, brother. A few days later, my brother wasn't just a dull person. Welcome! Four people? Okay, here's your table. I wanted to show my brother off to my friends and came to the place he works at. Large size with extra bean sprouts for table 10 is ready. Yosa for two is ready as well. Uh, serve it to table one and table four. Wow, he's really good at his job. He's shining, right? He's my proud brother. We're going to continue living together in good spirits. Looking for more interesting stories and videos? Then come check out other videos from Mani Mani people here. We'd love to hear your thoughts too. Drop a line in the comments below. See you soon.